Hey, what's up guys? So there are some really, really brilliant reasons to kind of kick your saving off right now. You know, sometimes when we think about whether we should save, why we should save, the decisions and the reasons aren't quite as clear. But let's just think about some of the things that we're seeing in the economy that everybody should be thinking about. So number one, housing. If you are renting, there's a really, really good chance that your rent has recently gone up. So when you think about it, your income may not be, but actually your expenses on your rent could definitely be go going up. Number two, the cost of fuel. If you look at where fuel prices are right now, fuel prices have been continuously tracking upwards. And the reality is a lot of those increases, they keep getting passed on, they keep coming down. So we've got to be prepared for it. Number three is the price of food. I would challenge anybody right now to look at the cost of their shopping a year, two years ago, and look at it now. Any inflation that you may be hearing about in the newspapers, in the press, honestly, it's more expensive and we all know it. We know that we're paying 10, 15, 20% more for different things. So we've got to find a way of making sure we can fund it. Those for me are the basics. When you think about your housing, you think about your fuel, you think about your, um, your food. Alongside fuel, you've got things like your utilities as well. So just think about the cost of gas, electric. It is unbelievable where prices are going. And this could just be the start. Now, for all those things I've just mentioned, we're expecting to maybe see interest rate increases, certainly in the UK, in the next few months. So if those rate increases get passed on to normal people like us who are consumers, the reality is costs go up again. So you're just looking at all the basic things you have in life, the basic, basic things, they are getting more expensive. Um, I don't really know about clothes because I don't really buy too many, but I suspect if you look at the um, inflation, the increase in prices of clothing, you're probably seeing a similar thing. So guys, you look at the basic things, the things that you consume all the time, they're going up in price. So good saving habits are essential to help you counter some of that price increase. Now, for those of you who are really lucky and are getting big wage increases, and it's probably not many people, frankly, then great. But you can still do more to make sure more of your extra money stays in your pocket and doesn't flow out to someone else who's not gone and done the hard work that you've done. Just a few reasons, guys. Let me know some of your other top, top reasons to get into a good saving habit. Good luck.